Hey everyone, welcome to today's day trading recap for Monday, June 7th. Super slow day today. Uh, ended up managing to scratch out a $55 profit on the day. Let's go through these. I'll show you what we did. Uh, One Mighty 90 in Roku booked $95. No pairs trades today. And then on the runners, one for one, uh, or one for two, I should say. Uh, NVIDIA plus 220 and then Roku minus 260. So that's it. Let me show you what we did here. The market, uh, well, let's just start with the, um, take a look at the futures for a second. Uh, I mean, the S&P and the Dow had some decent downside movement early in the morning. Uh, and then just kind of choppy NASDAQ, which obviously a lot of the stocks that we trade are NASDAQ related. NASDAQ just super choppy. And then the Russell, uh, kind of the opposite of the Dow, kind of pushed higher and then grinded higher. So uh, interesting dynamics. We have uh, a lot of stocks that are kind of pushing near highs of day and a lot of stocks that are pushing near lows of day. So just kind of some, some really weird price action today. So we were very conservative, stayed small, and just took a couple trades. So here's what we did, uh, starting with the Mighty 90 in Roku. Uh, Roku had this push up to the pivot, uh, a little bit of a volume pop, got short right here, just caught this little move down right there. Uh, ended up holding on to one, seeing if we had any more downside because the market looked like it may be getting weak and pushed up. So I ended up cutting out of my last one up here. So only booked a $95 profit on that one, but just super small position. Uh, and then in NVIDIA, NVIDIA took a downside runner. Uh, it was just you know, super choppy, super narrow range, finally broke out to the downside. And so when it bounced up, I got short right here uh, after this bounce and kind of chopped around for a while and then finally rolled over and got out of it right there. So book 220 on that one. And then on Roku did a runner as well. Uh, and on this one, I just I ended up just closing it out because I didn't want to babysit it anymore. It was just grinding sideways, kind of got theta, theta decayed to death. So had this big volume spike on this push, looked like it was going to start moving. So when it pulled back just a little bit, uh, got long, and then it just kind of went down and then just chopped around. So I literally just cut out of it uh, a little bit ago and just got out. So plus 55 on the day. We'll be streaming every day this week, so hopefully we get some, or, uh, some more action tomorrow. Uh, so we'll see you in the live stream room. See you then.